What's going on guys? Janos here and today I'm bringing this video to you guys about the marks. Yes, marks. One of my subscribers actually asked me to make a video about the mark and then like I got into my history and then I found that like yes, I have made a video on combo skill but not particularly about the mark. So uh, thanks to Kiki Kois Diantoro. Yes, that's how we spell right? <laughs> I mean pronounce. So anyways, uh, before starting this video guys, I would really love to recommend you guys to subscribe to my channel and please leave your views and opinions in the comment section below after this video. Alright, and now let's get this started. So what are marks? So now let's get into the servant section, right? And when you get into the servant section, you have to see, let's say, what, what am I just uh, selecting right now is Charlotte, right? Uh, let's say Fire Zeta. Let's do Fire Zeta, okay? And then uh, here, right here. Uh, we, when we click right over here on the combo skill, okay, as soon as you click on the combo skill, the primary mark right over here and the secondary mark, right, they pop up, okay. So what is the primary mark? The primary mark is the main mark or the main symbol of the combo skill of Fire Zeta right now. Every servant have like a unique, okay, uh, their own type of mark. Let's say for uh, Forest Valkyrza, right? Uh, what's a primary mark? It's something like uh, going upward. Anyways, uh, the problem is that like till now, uh, Air of Light has not really uh, announced the name of the mark. Okay, let's say, you know, like this mark is known as the hook or it's like an arrow. Or this has an hourglass. It's just like we are just assuming. But yes, uh, the name has not been announced yet so far. It would be really helpful if it was announced. But anyways, let's try to call it an arrow. Let's try to call it an hourglass for the reference of this video, okay? And uh, when it comes to the Fire Zeta, uh, at first it really doesn't appear because you are not selecting the combo skill. As soon as you select the combo skill, the primary mark and the secondary mark will pop up. Now what's really uh, up, what's up with the primary mark and the secondary mark? So, uh, let's say you are fighting in, with a team that has the same primary mark, okay? Uh, let's say you go into a team right over here. Let's say, let's go to the world boss and I will show you what ha what's happening, okay? Right over here and battle prep and see right over here. Uh, you can actually see the mark of every servants that at the bottom right corner, right? There's a small, the shining mark right over there. So, uh, for the Forest Charlotte, it's like that. And let's say I want to remove the anchor and put the Fire Zeta. Now you can actually see that the primary mark that is shown for the Forest Charlotte and the Fire Zeta are actually the same. So what will happen if they have the same mark? During the game, if you play, what happens like when one servant of the mark, let's say the Hourglass mark, or let's say the Charlotte, actually uses her combo skill, it will penalize the combo skill of Fire Zeta and vice versa. How that, uh, how so, <laughs> in a way that uh, when C, meaning the Fire Charlotte, uses her combo skill, the combo skill gauge of the Fire Zeta is reduced by 50%. Now that is a penalty, okay? So you have to still wait a long time before you can actually use the combo skill of Fire Zeta. So you have to be really, really careful in selecting your servants while you are actually trying to, uh, you know, uh, use them, okay? You should not be putting two DPS servant having the same mark. Anyways, let's try to get into the example, okay? I will try to show you the example. Your whole focus must be on the for Charlotte and the Fire Zeta, okay? And you guys will be clear about like what I really meant. So uh, look at the for Zeta, uh, Fire Zeta at the end and at the Charlotte, right? Both are nearly, both are nearly full, right? Now I'm gonna use the uh, yeah combo skill of the Zeta and just look at what happened to the combo skill gauge of the uh, for Charlotte. It halved, okay? It halved. And now let's try to use the, uh, you know, the combo skill of the Forest Zeta, uh, I mean like Forest Charlotte. And it also kind of reduced the, uh, you know, skill gaze of the uh, Fire Zeta by half, okay? That's what happens. That is called the penalize, okay? That's called the penalty. And the another thing right over there is now you can, uh, oh shit, the, <laughs> the combo did not trigger. 
what happens is like the combo will also trigger meaning like in a certain case that when your character is actually using a primary mark it has a certain chance of activating the secondary mark with the secondary mark activated what happens is that like your another uh, servant with the primary mark as same as the you know uh, the uh, second <laughs> secondary mark of the first character that who used the uh, uh, primary mark okay oh my god <laughs> it's kind of confusing just a minute just a minute let me uh, recollect my thinking all right so let's say the primary mark of the fire speaker right over here is the you know the hook right so when he's gonna use his combo skill there is a certain chance that he is gonna trigger the combo okay just like here okay lucky that it triggered and why it triggered okay three combo why did it uh, why did it trigger now i'm gonna explain it in the uh in the, you know like uh, just a little while a little, little bit later okay i'm nearly gonna die i'm nearly gonna die and then uh, yes another one of the finishing blow yes now i'm gonna show you how spiegel uh comboed into the forest charlotte and how forest charlotte actually connected the combo to the fire heat okay that's what happened in the video right you can actually replay the video in order to get the sequence now i'm gonna explain you how okay it's all thanks to the mark okay uh, so let's see how the mark really works so first it was fire spiegel right see right over here the fire spiegel his primary mark is a hook right let's call it a hook okay and then let's call it an hourglass so he has a hook and he has a secondary mark of an hourglass okay so you really need to uh, understand that like the secondary mark is actually the primary mark of the forest charlotte right isn't it so right over here see this is the prime primary mark and now her secondary mark is a hook right and this hook is actually the primary mark of fire heat so you get the connection that's how it happens and there is actually a certain chance or certain percentage on how much uh, the uh, a unit is gonna trigger the combo skill okay you can go into the info and it should be right over here at the bottom with these small letters it's just like you know in the cigarette uh, box it's written smoking is injurious to health small letters yeah right yeah the same small letter is right over here activate secondary mark okay so uh, it's 50 percent for a support character okay uh, if there is a support character then that means uh, he or she is gonna have a 50 percent uh, at the very beginning it's by default okay that's how it is but if it's a dps character you can see right over here by default it's basic it's 20 percent only okay like let's say for a tank it's a 20 percent but when it comes to a supporter it's 50 percent and let's see how much is it it is for the healer uh, where is my fireball kirza come on you woman right over here yeah 20 percent again so support are the ones that are really good with the you know activating the second secondary mark so uh that is also the reason why i actually geared him with the chain uh gears okay w what does chain gears do it actually increases the uh, you know like activation of secondary mark by 15 percent per set okay you can have a three set that's a 45 percent increase right and then when you actually go into right over here it's actually plus 48 percent why because obviously you can see that like uh, all the gears are actually gaining a little bit of uh, you know like a boost from the shining slot right a 10% boost right so that's how it goes so 50 plus 48 percent there is actually a 98 percent which I don't think really works <laughs> because in most of the scenario guys you know like he has a hard time comboing with my other servants that's how i have really seen because 98 percent is a huge boost okay it's nearly a hundred percent but but guys i you know like it's 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 uh it's kind of a little bit it's still a rare event for me to see him comboing with the forest charlotte or fire zeta because like fire zeta also has the hourglass as the primary mark so again uh, recalling back into the video Again, I would really love to say that, like, the primary mark of my fast Spiegel is a hook, right? And then it's a secondary mark is an hourglass. And what happened was that the secondary mark of the fast Spiegel happened to be the primary mark of Forest Charlotte. Right over here, see? The primary mark of the Forest Charlotte. And then the secondary mark of the Forest Charlotte happened to be the primary mark of the Fire 
uh, hid, okay, right over here. And if there was the secondary mark, which was which was which is supposed to be of uh, you know the fire Blavatsky, it would have been a perfect combo, guys. It would have been a perfect combo, meaning like everyone was connecting the combos okay so sometimes you can actually go up to four combos you can go up to three combos it really happens it really happens that way and then that would be super lucky scenario right so that's how it really happens uh, it's really for the combo skill and combo skills are really really awesome in this game you know why because it really helps you to deal more damage and at the same time when you are you when the combo skill uh, is activated it doesn't uh, deplete your combo skill gaze let's say uh because like whenever for a charlotte is actually using her combo skill right if she is using her combo skill then that means uh she is going to suffer or she is going to lose her all the combo skill gaze of her final skill right that's how that's the pro that, that's the scenario oh my god there's helicopter everywhere <laughs> i'm so sorry about that guys Anyways, uh, her combo skill would uh, skill gauge would have been depleted. But guess what? Uh, but guess what, guys? When the combo skill is actually activated, what happens is that like her combo skill gauge will not be depleted. Okay. Let's say if uh, if her combo skill gauge is nearly uh, full, let's say 90% or 100%, then she will be able to use it again okay right over there again after the combo skill finishes you can actually see that like she will be able to use her combo skill again so that is a lot of damage boost okay that is really good and you would really love it guys so that's how the combo skill really works guys i hope this really helped you a lot guys and this is it for today guys i hope you enjoyed this video please don't forget to in uh subscribe to my channel to keep on enjoying the contents like this and guys please leave your views and opinions in the comment section below about this video please add to the information if you guys have additional information let me know i would really love to know it and please let the community know okay let our subscriber base know it the audience and see you guys in the next video